Hello. I hope you're all doing well. Uh, if you're anything like me, you're a uh, little feel a little shut in lately. I know I've spent most of the past week or more kind of here at home with my family and with my dog Molly. And man, do I miss our Veterans Breakfast Club events. I mean, you know, it, it just hurts my heart to have to cancel all those wonderful uh, veteran storytelling events that, that we had scheduled for this month and next month. And uh, I've been spending a lot of time telling Molly the stories that I've heard at the Veterans Breakfast Club. The problem is Molly is, well, she's kind of the greatest generation of dogs. She's 16 years old. She's almost entirely deaf. She has um, pretty serious canine dementia. She um, also wears a diaper. So, you know, kind of talking with Molly can be a challenge. She's, she's a very good girl, but I really need to connect with other people. You're a good girl, Molly. All right. Um, you know, I, I, feel, I feel the need to kind of really connect with our VBC community again. And we've been working on ways to how to do that. I mean, we want to be able to continue to deliver on our mission of creating communities of listening around veterans and their stories at a time when we can't do live events. And so we've developed this, we're developing this line of programming that we call VBC at Home. And VBC at Home will be a way to use social media to connect and heal and educate and inspire through veteran stories. And our first VBC at Home event will be a live streamed live event. We're calling it a VBC Town Hall that will be on Facebook at 1 p.m. on Wednesday, March 25th. Now, uh, you could just tune in at, at 1 p.m. On, on Wednesday and kind of be a part of, of this conversation that we're gonna have, this live town hall event that we're gonna have. Um, but if you can't make it, that's fine. There'll be a recording of it. You'll be able to hear, kind of uh, share what the plans that we have to keep connected on social media. And we also wanna gather your thoughts about how you think we could stay connected and what needs that you think are out there um, that the VBC might be able to meet. Now, we, we're also gonna be using a new platform called Crowdcast at the same time. And if you wanna join us on Crowdcast for this town hall, uh, you'll see the link. There's a link in instructions below. Uh, maybe it's above, it's somewhere around here. There are instructions about how to connect to, to Crowdcast. It involves signing up and you know, uh, using entering your, your, your email. But what that will allow you to do is we'll be able to bring you on air and you'll be able to, through your webcam, you know, you'll be able to communicate directly with the audience and ask us questions. We'll be able to have a dialogue kind of back and forth on camera. Uh, so that's if you want to be, you know, connect to us with the webcam, you could you could connect to this town hall on Crowdcast. If not, you could just watch it and type in questions and comments on Facebook. And this town hall will be the first of what we hope will be many live events, which will be kind of like our breakfast and like our evening events where we have veterans come together and share stories with the public. Um, uh, for example, we'd love to hold a live event involving anybody in the Guard and Reserve. We'd love to hear kind of what your life has been like this past two or three weeks. Uh, what plans you have uh, maybe to go out there and start working to, to keep us all safe from this. So I'm sure things have been very busy and hectic and chaotic for you. Uh, and we'd love to, love to hear your stories. Uh, we'd also love to be able to, um, kind of collect any videos, vlogs that you like right now, like what I'm doing. Uh, you know, you talking to the camera, maybe telling a story of your service. You send it to us, would put it online and, and, you know, be able to kind of comment on it and, and ask you questions about it. Uh, I know I'm going to be doing a lot of vlogging, a lot of these kind of videos that maybe sharing some stories that we've heard over the years at our breakfasts and may, maybe sharing some histories, history as well. Um, you also, many of you know that I'm a historian and I, while I no longer teach and don't do much writing, i still do a lot of public lectures and of course they've all been canceled. And so what I thought I would do is, uh, either live stream some lectures or record some illustrated lectures uh, that I could post, you know, lectures about um, subjects that would interest the Veterans Breakfast Club community, um, you know, the kind of history that, that many of you have been a part of. Um, so we're making plans to do that. Uh, if you're a gamer, let's say that you like to play online games, uh, we're creating, where well, we have created a, a Discord channel. It's just kind of a platform for anybody who games could come together and get in touch and connect with one another 
uh, talk back and forth while you're gaming. Um, and we have the wonderful Marine James Martin who is setting that, that up for us. Um, and of course, we also know that there are uh, many uh, in our community that, that don't have internet access and who, who you know, don't use a computer. And so we've created a VBC buddy check system where we have volunteers making phone calls to people just to check in to see how they're doing, see if they need anything, and see if there's any, th any service like we could provide, the VBC could provide during these difficult times. So um, I look forward to talking more about all this kind of in real time, face to face, at least, you know, and uh, remotely. Um, at, uh, at 1 p.m. on Wednesday, March 25th in our Facebook VBC Town Hall. Please do join us, and I hope to see you soon.